what is some advice you can give somebody that you're in a relationship with that doesn't have their parents' support? A relationship is between you and that person. Mm -hmm. So I think that advice that I can give to someone is that if they don't have the support from the parents, um, it's if your relationship is genuine and it's real, eventually the parents will grow into loving you. Um, and it really shouldn't, parents shouldn't validate y'all relationship. Okay. To me, to answer that question, to me, it's all about actions. And if, you know, I'm dating uh, someone's daughter and I'm telling uh, dad that I'm going to show you better than I can tell you, I'm going to, you know, treat your daughter with respect and treat your daughter the right way like you would treat her, my actions is going to prove everything. You know, me just talking to the dad and telling him what I'm going to do, mm -hmm. you know, kind of really don't mean much. My actions are going to show you that I'm going to treat your daughter with respect and I'm going to treat your daughter as in if, if you was dating her, you know. So actions always speak louder than words, always have, always will. So my thing to someone, if they was going through that, just, just, just let your actions speak. Don't let your mouth speak. Let your actions speak. And uh, I think everything else will do the rest. So I have a question, babe. Being that you have a daughter, do you treat your lady differently now that you do have a daughter? I have more sympathy for it. And, I, you know, it gives me a, a different point of view to, to not to react to stuff so, uh, so uh, out of control. I would just leave it at that. You know, I would just, it kind of gave me a, a patience. pause. Patience and a more pause moment to be like, you know, I can understand what you're dealing with, you know. I have a daughter now, you know, so it gives me the, the a point of view of a woman more. Mm -hmm. So I definitely think it, it, it's definitely going to change me. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't feel it just yet, but maybe it is changing me, but I don't feel it just yet. I think but, so. But, you know, maybe it's going to change me. It's going to change me and it's going to always change, change you for the better. So, you know, uh, you know, I wanted to have a daughter, so I'm, I'm blessed to have a daughter. I'm blessed to have a daughter with you. So, uh, you know, Hopefully, you know, it uh, changed me for the better, you know, because I'm, I'm always looking to, you know, change is good. Change, change is good for, for the most part. Uh, so, you know, having a little Capri is going to be, definitely going to be good. A life-changing thing. Yes. Yeah. Are you going to be like a strict dad or are you going to be an easy dad when it comes to who your daughter, ah. <laughs> who your daughter chooses in uh, life? I don't know the movie, but it's the movie with 50 Cent, Ice Cube, son. <laughs> It's the movie when they was robbing banks and stuff, and uh, 50 Cent daughter had a guy come over to take her to prom. You're going to scare him. And he is introduced basically what you're saying. him you're to scare all him. his <laughs> friends. They was in the gym lifting weights, and the guy looked like he was scared to death. And I'm not going to do that yes, until my daughter get ready to go to prom. And <laughs> yes, I'm going to tell the guy, look, have my daughter back by 9. Not well, 901, and, and not 930, <laughs> 9 o'clock. And if why? you don't have her back by 9 o'clock, these all the guys are going to be coming after your ass. <laughs> so I'm definitely going to be a strict dad, but I'm definitely going to let my daughter have freedom too. But I'm definitely going to be that dad to be like, you seen my daughter? Where my daughter at? So I'm definitely going to be that dad uh, like that. Just, you know, just kind of just, because this is a crazy world we live in. You know, a lot of things are happening, mass shootings, uh, a lot of crazy things. So I'm definitely going to be that dad that's always on his P's and Q's when it comes to his children, his family. You know, it's, it's a crazy world we're living in right now, crazy times right now. So uh, I'm definitely going to be that dad that definitely be on the lookout. I wouldn't say strict. i will more say be on head on a swivel. Definitely. If you know Devon, you know Devon don't play. Yeah. So <laughs> He does not play about the woman he loves. Yeah. The women 100%. he loves the in women, his life. Yeah. Facts. <laughs>